tenga yeshu kuti eh bengeko happy men indlela bekwenza ngakhona because sometimes we can kick iu tete eh maisebu i reports ithi reports kick be 15 Better to be tax. Go on a foot low fifteen. No, how we born is so what's gonna happen to your six album contract now with ambitious? I they must find out because uh, I don't care. But you signed a contract. Yeah, I unfortunately. The albums. I'm so full in German. Maru saini. Eh ngisaini le so. So you have to you have to I need to you are fighting that they didn't for me man. You are fighting that they didn't adhere to 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 their side of the country. This is more like nyakthanda and sakthand. Maru you can't do that in both. Okay, uma shati. Hi, why? Uma shati like mele se kandola. You start you, you start controlling yeah. when to come and when not yeah. to come, right? Yeah. And 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 you start understanding that even if it's sex, it is not really about you. Yes, right? yes. Mm, this yeah. person needs to be satisfied first. Oh, Thank God. Yes. Not guaranteed, but for her it's not. Yeah. So I need to make sure that she gets satisfied. Give her yeah. So yeah, what what? <laughs> Give her <an> assist. <laughs> you can't just go. You need assist sometimes, right? <laughs> right? So so then. then You didn't like uh, the Pearl T.C. song by MT when it came out. No, that's not true. Is it? I thought it was a prank. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, because man, his manager at the time came to live to play the song for me and give me a copy of the lyrics mm. to say, to ask me to approve them because they want me. They want. They wanted my buy-in. Mm, your co-sign. And I thought it was like, then the song came out. Then the song actually did amazing things. Yeah, it was huge. That song. Yeah. Massive. Yeah, I'm at 226. Yeah. From Pakistan. Sure. Yeah. I'm going to get there now. I'm going to get there. 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 The office. Yeah. Because the vendor is never going to get there. Yeah. 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 Bela Manizo, o fila be ano o ba o zedo be ano kubana ba na ba ba tu kuba ko bela ngo shaja kuwa o vile limfano mumwe. Last. Kodan. Kodan boy. So. So Kodan, if una midari amai angeli, angela bara na ba banana na ba avocado. So. Yeah, listen, Big Zulu, I didn't understand half of the things you said today, but I'm gonna watch the subtitles, but it sounded like you were saying some real shit. So Nkulma now I'm gonna say something. I'm gonna say something. Ngikuza ihinga ngayinga hi ngayi mina athi ngikuzwa angilibana nama ungangizwa ama risulu sakho sidibe kanda ngisifaka ngisokwe futhi kuwe bengifaka isoka soft isoka not soft isoka not socks not socks elo muntu lo wodwa kulesinomunye kulela amasababs man wabona mina manga khulumisa vena never was a good thing ngithi kusho bani o asihamba esivenda arihamba esivenda eh arihamba esivenda Uta sambe se vende. Did music as well. I remember you did that speakery song. Yes, that was a game making. Yeah, it was just you have fun. Yeah. yeah, it's what you know. You don't need money for it. You don't care whether it sells or not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's just for fun, and it was so much fun. Yeah. I yo I rode on that cloud. Yeah. Yeah, current. Yeah. I got bookings, performed, and I had an album after that, and then. But they booked me for current, yes, yes. and I would perform for 30 minutes. 25 minutes of my show is dark. a lot of your uh, reality show, right? Mm. And I see you very, very big into um, you know giving back mm. and showing love charity. to your ancestors, not charity, your ancestors. Oh. You know, um, but don't you think like that is something that should be uh, like in private? closed doors? Yeah, something no, private. No, that. Mm. Because then you are the same people that are gonna say, 
uh, he's only showing us the lavish side, the mm. Louis Vuittons, the mm. the yachts, the private jets, and don't, don't. is that his reality? Is that all that that we is all about? No, mm. I I paid all. That's why it took me forever to do a reality show. Because I said I'm gonna give you my all, at least ninety percent. Mm. You know, I mean the the rest who I'm shagging. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, blah, that's, that's the ten percent. Yeah, yeah. That's the part that's supposed to be private. Yeah, yeah. But when it comes to who I really am, and I also wanted to show, Ruri, we as Africans, we tend to to glorify other people's uh, religions yes. and traditions. Mm, mm. And I mean, we're quick to, to say situation right now and pose in front of Rema. Mm. And, and yet when I go to visit my ancestors, I must hide it. Mm. It's, it's not a dark side. Yeah. It's a very beautiful side. It's a bright side. It's actually the reason why I have all these amazing things happening in my life. Yeah. So I must show you yeah. with pride. Where, where did that start from? Like, was it your, your, your parents? Did they show No, you? that's after the, the three years okay. as well. Yes. I knew there's a story behind it. Yes. That. That's yeah. after the, the three years taught me a whole lot of things. Taught me to get rid of people. Taught okay. me to, to find myself as mm-hmm. an African man. Yeah. Because I, I can, just because I'm gay doesn't mean I'm less of a man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? You could uh, probably beat me up if you wanted to. Like, big time, dude. Like, yo, dude, yo, yeah. I'll sort you out. <laughs> uh, <laughs> So yeah, that three has taught me to find myself and uh, connect with my ancestors uh, because I've neglected them for, for the longest. Mm. And look at me now. Uh, let's talk about idols, ne? Yeah. Uh, because honestly, uh, before you came on idols, I stopped watching. Uh. But ever since you've been on, like you know, I can't stop watching because mm. I think you're amazing. Thank you're you. very funny, and every time you open your mouth, something. Um, magical happens. Mm-hmm. How did that come about? Did they approach you or did they you approach did, them? They did, eh? No, I've, I would never even think I would be a judge on idols. Yeah. They did. I was a choreographer for season 10. And I think when they like they record us for comments, what do you think of the this contestant? And I would give my comments it's where they saw potential. Mm. Or they saw something special because I didn't. So when they called me, I thought they were firing, firing me actually from being a choreographer. Because usually I did it for two years, choreography. They would let me know around what now September, around August, because they start recording in September. So they would let me know around that time mm-hmm. to say we're doing choreographs. And so this time they called me around December, no November, before actual idols ended. Yeah. And then they said. Will you consider doing a charge on Alice? Wow. Yes, like, what? Wow. Oh, God, I was excited. Then I, and and you're not even thinking about the paycheck at that time, mm-hmm. just the platform. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I was excited because I, I knew that I was going to bring something special yeah. and I've wanted that opportunity, but I didn't know it was going to be this. That also changed my status to Yeah, yeah I and took you. When they told me, they said, so easy, no amount of money is going to buy what I was going to do for you. you. And, and they were like, right, right? Ah, oh, I don't know. Yeah. I mean, it's been running for 10 years. What's <laughs> going to be wow about it? Ha- have the numbers uh, gone up since you've been on? Hugely. Nice. nice. Thank you. Ooh, Shem. Thank you. <laughs> you are so cute. <laughs> All right, thank you, Samiz. <laughs> 6.5 billion rands. That is how much Sonal Ramaphosa is worth. But he only earns 3 million rand a year as president of South Africa. So where did all his money come from? In 2001, he started Chanduka Investments and bought 145 McDonald's restaurants. The Big Mac has made it to South Africa. This happened after 10 years of him being in the ANC. This is why the ice cream machine in McDonald's never worked because he came from the ANC. Through his contacts, he bought shares in MTN, Coca-Cola, Standard Bank, Alexander Forbes, Liberty Group, Hoodvest, and Seacom. So in the last 20 years, his businesses have made so much money, but he had to step away from them when he was running for president in 2015. We may think it's a good idea to have a billionaire businessman running our country, but sometimes businessmen only think about themselves. How can a president, when uh, metros are going, the biggest part of what is your constituency is going? Someone must tell me, what did Ramaphosa do to save the metros? One thing, one. What, except the underground movement of the Oppenheimers 
and uh, trying to facilitate deals amongst their, their, their puppets and those they fund. What did Ramaphosa do? Transparent. Where have you ever had such a thing? Where a party president, the party is losing power. The party president does nothing about it. We were told Ramaphosa is the best negotiator. But Ramaphosa has always been a fraud. He was sold to us by white media and white capital. But he's the best negotiator because he was repeating after what whites are saying in the negotiations. That's what made him the best negotiator. Then, the real time for negotiation came. Ramaphosa was nowhere to be found. So, where was the skills of the best negotiator? Look what happens in Deben. You know who got Deben? It was Jacob Zuma. Our SG was told by that guy who won, who, who switched sides of ABC. Mavunda that, no, let me put Zuma on the line. I'm talking to Zuma. Let's, put, let's talk to Zuma. Let me put Zuma on the line. Is Zuma an ace who negotiated a Teguini and won a Teguini? RET forces are the ones who won a Teguini. They were fighting there. Where was CR17? Where was the president of the ANC when all of this was happening? Cyril did not try. Why? His project of killing the ANC is working well. Is succeeding. Why must he go around negotiating for the survival of the ANC when his project is performing well? Where was Cyril Ramaphosa when his party was losing power in the metros? What role did Cyril Ramaphosa play to save the ANC because we told he was going to save the ANC when his party was losing metros? And then we are told, no, Cyril is the best man. What we, we are living to prove that Ramaphosa has never been a leader, he has always been a project. Now he assumed a leadership responsibility and is getting exposed that he has got no capacity, none whatsoever. Now, they are crying all over social media. Hey, Malema sold out, Malema, as if I'm their father. Hmm? They don't know where their father is. They must go and look for that big nose where he is. They must not say for me, I, I sold them out. I never sold them out. I'm not their father. I'm not their father. What do they want from me, these witches? They must leave me alone. They must go to hell and burn. We have no sympathy for the ANC. There's no friendship here. We are in politics here. Are, there's no friendship. We are not friends when it comes to politics. We are not leading a stock fail. We are leading a well-oiled machinery determined to collapse the ruling party and the Oppenheimers who are the financiers of Cyril Ramaphosa, Mashaba, and DA. We don't get any money from Oppenheimers. They will never tell us what to do and what not to do. We do that which we think is in the best interest of our people. Thanks. Some other people who are making that video to trend is those people who always who are always waiting for those uh, mistakes so that people they will they will try maybe to tarnish my cousin's name because of that. So to those people, so you understand. But beside that, guys, I'm very much sorry uh, for those who felt offended about that video. I, it was not intentional. I didn't want to. I was not meaning to hurt her. Uh, unfortunately, you guys didn't understand uh, the.